Hello, today I am going to be talking about the citric acid cycle. The citric acid cycle is also known as the Krebs cycle. This cycle is one of the two other steps of cellular respiration. The first step of cellular respiration is called glycolysis. And the next step is the citric acid cycle. The citric acid cycle takes place in the mitochondrial matrix. Also, this cycle only occurs when there is oxygen present. Before we jump into discussing the citric acid cycle, let's first take a look at the two pyruvate molecules that are left over from glycolysis. As you can see, the two pyruvate molecule turns into acetylcoenzyme A. Acetyl-CoA will then enter the Krebs cycle. The next step is citrate and then isocitrate. I have shown the three products that come out of this. They are CO2, NAD+, and NADH. This happens twice. Next, I have demonstrated that GTP goes into ADP and GDP goes into ATP. The next step includes the cisinate, which two products come out, FAD and FAD2. Next, fumarate, then pulls out the product H2O. Malate is the next step and the products NAD plus and NADH are pulled out. Lastly, oxaloacetate ends the cycle. Now, the citric acid cycle turns twice per glucose molecule. One turn produces three NADH, one FADH2, and two CO2. So the final products of the Krebs cycle are six NADH, two FADH2, four CO2, and two ATP. I hope you now have a better understanding of the Krebs cycle.